Hi guys, I'm Johnny. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make a chicken and broccoli stir fry. It is so delicious, very easy to make, and I think you're gonna love it. So let's get started. You will need chicken breast cut into one inch cube, or pieces, flour, brown ginger, chicken stock, minced garlic, soy sauce, honey, onion, broccoli, and oil. I'm using vegetable oil, but Additionally, you can use a little bit of seasonal oil if you want. So the first thing that I'm going to do is just coat my flour, my chicken with the flour. I'm going to coat it there. So to my pan that is over medium high heat, I'm going to add some oil. This is just flavorless oil. And I'm going to let it heat up there. My oil seems to be at the right temperature, so I'm going to add my chicken on. So you're just gonna cook it there for about five minutes until it's brown. In the same bowl you have your, your chicken, you're going to add your chicken stock, your garlic, ground ginger, you can also use fresh, but I but I didn't have fresh, so I'm gonna use ground, soy sauce, the honey. And you're going to whisk that up there and set it aside. This is going to be our thickening too. That's why we do it in the in the bowl, so there's no moss, no salt. Everything is simple. My chicken cooked for eight minutes and it's beautifully black, <laughs> black, brown. And I'm just going to take it out now. Once you have removed your chicken from the pan, in the same pan you're going to add some oil and you're going to cook your onions and broccoli for about 4 minutes until crisp, crisp tender. Give it a stir here and there during the cooking time. After those 4 minutes you're going to go ahead and you're going to stir your sauce. Stir and cook it for about, for about maybe 2 minutes or until it thickens. Once the sauce has thickened, you're going to go ahead and stir in your chicken. Give everything a nice stir and cook your chicken for about 20 seconds just to warm it up. And that is it. Serve this over over rice, over white rice and it will be so good. I hope you give this recipe a try because it was really delicious and I think you're going to really love this recipe. So that was it for today's video. I hope you give it a try. And if you do, let me know how you go. I would love to hear from you. And i see you next time. Bye-bye.